I'm Sarah Hashimaris in the Los Angeles Times newsroom. If you happen to be watching the National Memorial Service for Nelson Mandela, chances are you saw a fake sign language interpreter on stage. According to reps of Organizations for Deaf People, the unidentified man didn't even know how to sign South Africa or thank you and seemingly made up random gestures as he went along. The so-called interpreter has been used at previous events hosted by the African National Congress, the nation's governing political party. Complaints about his signing abilities were reportedly made last year to the ANC. Many expressed anger on social media, including deaf lawmaker Wilma Newhout, who tweeted that the man should be removed from the stage. The South African government is said to be looking into the matter, according to a spokesman. The Times reports the scandal was one of several glaring problems in South Africa's organization of the Mandela Memorial events and funeral. Many seats in the stadium remained empty for the memorial. There were complaints of inadequate or non-existent security checks, despite the presence of more than 90 world leaders and South African President Jacob Zuma was booed, an embarrassment the state-owned television network attempted to cover up. Let's not forget President Obama's now viral selfie with the Danish and British Prime Ministers sans First Lady Michelle Obama, which some are calling tasteless. Mandela's body will lie in state at the seat of South Africa's government in Pretoria and is expected to draw a large number of mourners. For more, visit LATimes.com and at LATimes World on Twitter for the latest updates.